Yeah, I've gone drifting before. Recovering from a skid counts, right? Dodge Charger. For the man who has a losing record against targeted advertising. Oh, a Lincoln Continental. I love you guys so much. A Lincoln Continental is the car that the models lay across if you're making a pinup calendar of the labor union's local 2546527. I haven't seen a nose this long since Pinocchio told me I could be 6'1 when I grew up. If life were a video game, you'd unlock the Lincoln Continental after winning enough games of darts. This is a car for rappers in the same way the Escalade is. If by rappers you just mean people who work at Rite Aid who have a SoundCloud. Alright, this one's gonna be weird, but am I the only person who doesn't hate Matt Black for a car? I know that intellectually, as an enthusiast, I shouldn't like it. And I don't, but I don't hate it either, you know what I mean? Can-Am Defender. This looks like the kind of utility vehicle driven by a rich guy who hunts people on his own land. Yo mama so fat, the only car she ever been in was a Carvel to get an ice cream cake. Yo mama so dumb, she called you on her cell phone for help finding her cell phone. Yo mama so ugly, her health insurance referred her to a vet. Yo mama so loose, she must be from the local bird sanctuary, because you'll always find a cockatoo in her. Yo mama so big, Taylor Swift had to use her private jet to get around her at the meet and greet. Yo mama so wide, she walked past me in the morning and I ended up missing the sunset. Yo mama so... You know, this ain't right, man. I agree. It feels like we're just disrespecting the women that gave us life. All for clout. I'm sorry, bro. I'm sorry, too. You want some Pocky? Hell yeah, man, I want some Pocky! Do, 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 do. Oh, I didn't know George R.R. R. Martin made cars. Pontiac Chieftain. 1950s style with a 0 to 60 time of kids these days don't understand the value of a dollar point dag nabbit seconds. So this whole trad wife thing, it's... It's a kink, right? Like, like... It's a, it's a kink, but like nobody's calling it a kink, but it's a kink. My car declined at rehab, so they put all the drugs back in me. The police appeal to the public for help in identifying the suspect in an armed robbery. License plate 000, 000, 000, 000, 000, 000, 1. The official car of auction sellers who put no reserve when they don't really mean no reserve. Look, if you're putting no reserve on that bad boy, you better mean it or you are in for a rude awakening. Okay, so I'm pretty sure this isn't for kids, but if it's for adults, it's something that also appeals to kids, I guess. So, I don't know, it's sort of like if YouTube's trending page had wheels. I want it. 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 Please don't drive this around here. We don't want the children thinking that being an influencer is a viable career path. People will spend six figures on a car like this and then throw a filter over it when they post it to Instagram. This looks like the kind of car you drive when your chief just asks you to turn in your badge. This looks like the kind of car you drive when you call yourself a bounty hunter as an excuse to carry an unregistered 32. Okay, I can't even pretend or force myself to rag on this. It's too beautiful. This looks like it should be surrounded by Art Deco architecture. This is gorgeous. This is my favorite BMW here. How are you at the Philly Auto Show and looking like you snuck into the Philly Auto Show? I want it. My Tesla is best Tesla because the warranty is voided. A Polaris slingshot is like if you ask somebody to draw the bottom of a broken vase in MS Paint. The Polaris Slingshot is a car for people who don't have anybody in their lives to tell them they can't dance. 
BMW i8. Because if the planet dies, how will I flex on my enemies? Hey, I know a guy who sells baby aspirin behind the Carl's Jr. This car looks like it's going to offer me a promo code for better help. How does a car have a giant can of iced tea next to it and still look dehydrated? This is the kind of car you drive when you pull up to a car show and there's already someone waiting there to kick you out of it. Too soon. Oh dear, it's like somebody made an RC car out of my 10th grade backpack. Aw, someone made a scale model of Radwood. This is my toy car. Action figures beware. A car like this just screams buying classic video games at a flea market and then reselling them at 30% markup. You know, it's only a matter of time until Netflix butchers this one, too. A perfect ATV for driving around your property, if your property is the bullet farm. The official truck of asking your friend for a thousand bucks and being given an impossible amount of venison. <laughs> This car is like if I asked AI to make a car out of my live journal post from high school. Have you heard the good word? If you'll give me a moment of your time, we would like to preach to you the gospel of VTech. Please, let us read to you from the book of High Rev Elation. Yes, repent and embrace the Honda. Well, wait a minute, I'm a Kia. I'm not a Honda Civic. Or am I? The red wheels add 20 horsepower. This looks like it wants to give me unsolicited gym advice. For the man who says, If you want to get to them, you gotta go through me! As urine soaks through the front of their jeans. Come on, guys. Let's turn this frat house into a frat home. Look at all these bad boys. It's like a watch party for every friend who thinks they're Mystery Science Theater 3000 and have to shout jokes at the screen every two minutes. Arrakis is Arrakis, and the desert takes the weak. Yeah, I come to car shows to look at stuff like this because the only rolls I can afford come from a bakery.